Right, so I'm going to be unboxing the Motorola something in 2019, and you can tell it's got a number three on the box itself. So what is up, guys? It's myself, Rob Fusion 4, and we're doing some more unboxings on the channel. Yay! So let's do this, guys. Are you ready for this one? Right then. So this is one of the best finds that I've got from CEX for £9.99. So literally just paying £10 for this thing, but I'm really amazed with the condition of it as well. Are you ready for this? Let's go! So this is the Bad Boy Motorola V3X and I love the colour from it as well. So as you all can see, it's locked to three and I managed to get hold of it because I've been trying to get hold of this phone for quite a while but to get it nowadays, you're talking about like 200, 300 pounds if you got to get these brand new. So these are very difficult to get hold of. So I thought I'd just make a video on that as well because I love my... Uh, Gadgets and my uh, gizmos and all my Like collection of phones as well. So this is like the clamshell design of it. I actually do miss this as well But I'm really surprised it does still work and The condition of it is just not so bad just got a lot of cosmetic wear on it as well It's a bit sticky. So that's why I bought it for ten pounds and what I like about it It's got the number three logo on it as well Yeah, the early downside of it the battery uh, sticker is just not too good, but I'll show you that in a minute. So we got the SIM card in there, which is already in there. So I'll put that, uh, when was it, yesterday. And this one can hold up to two gigabytes. So let's unbox the rest of it then. Right, so what have we got in here? Let's take that off. We got the standard UK wall charger. And that's the other bit that goes on it. But if this flips out, this is actually a American charger. So this is a US charger. And it actually just fits onto the UK plug itself. So that just flips down there like that, which is pretty unique. Can't even see what I'm doing because I'm holding this through the phone. <laughs> right, that's it. Goes on there like that. Yeah, if I could get this thing on properly. Um, just give me a minute, guys. Right. Oh, bagger. I even got this on. Right, there we go. There we go, that's it. You got the standard wall plug there. Wall charger, I should say. Put that there. And then, what have we got in here? So this is the battery I was on about. Yeah, that's the only thing that's missing is the actual battery sticker, but the battery does work. So let's put this in, guys. Right, if we could just put it in there like that. God, I'm just so amazed that I paid £10 for this thing. <laughs> and I'm so hyped for the Motorola Razr V Throb because uh, that's coming out this year, isn't it? Right, let's turn this thing on, see if it works. Oh, okay. Right, I actually do miss the Motorola splash screen there. Hello, Moto. How are we doing? Right, so while that's turning on, let's see what else is in the box. So we got the mini USB lead. We got the headset, which has not been opened yet. Oh my goodness, and you got the earbuds there. Yeah. Right, so this is the SIM card that came with it as well. Oh, bloody hell. This is such a brilliant find. Right, we got the Motorola phone tools, which is a software that goes on... To, um, that works originally for Windows XP, but I'm sure it does actually work on Windows 10 because I know Windows 10 can actually take the older software, but you've got to re run them in uh, compatibility mode. And we got the user guide here, so it shows you how to use the phone and how to get started. So I'm literally happy that all the bits actually came with this phone. But that's about it. So one more thing or a few more things we got is the manufacturer's guarantee, the user information. And it, I can see it's well updated now. It's over a 10 year old phone. So this is what you can discover with 3. I actually do remember that 3 did actually launch its very own network. But 3 is definitely the best network to go on if you're in the UK. And plus you can use it abroad as well. So Planet 3 is just like a 3 website. It will take you straight to that. God. Right. There's more to it. Let's see if the phone has actually turned on. Have we got this yet? Yeah. Right, just give us a minute. Right, let's go. 
Okay. I swear I did turn the phone on, guys. Right, so while that's turning on once more... Right, there we go. We got the boot screen logo going up there. So we got the three splash screen, and I actually do like that. Right, so I actually do miss this layout, guys. Right, so we got messages, camera, web access. Right, I only got this SIM card for this because I needed to access the phone because it doesn't... Um, boot up when there's no sim card in there so i actually do miss the oh we got camera video camera videos yeah this is like a um, multimedia center and what i like about it is the it's got the mechanical camera focus on it and this is one of the best motorola phones that you could take selfies with it because i could actually do remember that you did take selfies right go to video mode internal view Right, you can actually uh, flick uh, camera angles on this, which is pretty awesome. And this supports 3G as well, to be honest. And you can even watch YouTube on it as well. Or even stream live radio on it if you've got unlimited internet. But yeah, let's see what this has, what games it's got. Okay, got styles, uh, vibrate and ring, but the vibration on this is just so powerful. <laughs> I'm not talking dirty minded, so sorry guys about that. Right, so let's see what the games are like. No, how do I even get... Right, main menu. Right, okay. Right, apps and games. Games and apps, if we can find it. Settings. Uh, Yeah, there we go. Right, so we got its own music player. The Jumbo Rumble. Millionaire RB Zumba. <laughs> okay. Right, so this is this was actually Java driven software on it. So it currently says this service is currently unavailable because all it can uh, do is it will access the internet first before loading a game. So I'm presuming there's no it's, there's no updates for this game anymore because a lot of their apps on here they're well outdated. But the phone does actually work brilliant, brilliantly though. But I just got to say thank you guys for watching and this is one of my rare fine phones that I've got in 2019. So take care guys and if you're new to the channel make sure you subscribe and hit that notification bell so you don't miss a thing. But peace out yo!